If you have SoundCloud, you want to have a lot of awesome fans that enjoy your music. Here are five tips to get your first 100 subscribers, maybe within a week. So let's dive in. Tip number one, have a professional profile. This may sound obvious, but this is really key to getting the best quality fans on your SoundCloud profile. So upload a decent banner and a decent profile picture that really represents you as an artist. Also, you need to add links to the most important websites for you. So that might be your website or that might be a sign up page to get them on an email list. But it also can be your Spotify or iTunes link or your YouTube channel link. And the description of your SoundCloud profile should just be enough to inform your new fans of what they can expect on your channel. It doesn't have to be like a 10 page story of how you started back in the day. You just have to explain them what type of music they can expect from you and maybe even a little bit what your future plans are, what you are working on, but make it as short and informative as possible and this will increase the chance to get a new fan whenever they see your profile. Tip number two is going to be upload high quality audio tracks. So you can get away with some demo sounds sometimes, but really try to focus on the best quality music that you have. It will represent you in the best way possible as an artist, the same as your high quality profile and banner is going to do. Low quality music is probably not gonna let people stick on your profile and they probably will not follow you because it doesn't really represent the best part of you, like the artist part of you. So upload high quality sounds, high quality music, and go from there. Tip number three is going to be try to interact with fellow SoundCloud users. If you are on SoundCloud, then there is a high chance that you create music. And yes, there are people on SoundCloud just to consume, just to listen to sounds and they don't really have music for themselves, but still you can have conversations and go to their page and maybe start an interaction in some way or form. You can click on any of the songs that they have on their platform and just comment on them. Be nice and add your first impression uh, as a comment. Like, I really like this sound. I didn't really expect it to be so awesome. Whatever works best for you and whatever works best for the tone of you as an artist, that can really help to get the conversation going. And that is also a great way to get the first connections with people on the platform. So if you like a song and if you comment on that and if you follow that person, there is also a high chance that they will follow you back. This is a great way to get the first interactions with your possible fans. So this action will kind of get the ball rolling and if you continue doing this every day or maybe even every week, then this will be the best way to get your first fans to your profile. That is why your profile needs to be as professional as possible because you want them to stick once they see your profile. Tip number four, try to share your music on the best platforms out there. So if you are on Facebook, on Twitter or Instagram, you might have found that there are some groups or maybe some groups of hashtags that you can use on Twitter or Instagram that can attract a new audience. So try to find out what works the best in your niche, in your genre of music, because it's really different in every genre of music. And once you have found that, try to be consistent with posting with those tags and in those groups. Share your music as much as possible, but just don't overshare. Maybe once a week is good enough. We go to tip number five. What you also should share is things that are not about you. One big mistake that you can make what actually can make you lose subscribers is if you only post stuff about yourself. If you post your same song every single day, if you share your song in DMs, or if you never react on anybody else's song or something like that, that makes it feel like it's just all about you and people will not like that. Your new fans, they hopefully will like your music, but they will also want to like you as a person. So try to mix and match with stuff that you have been making, but also try to find ways to connect with them. So also talk about topics that they might like and they are interested in and share that and try to get a conversation going. That is really powerful and it will really help you to grow your fan base on SoundCloud. 
So if you want more tips like these, don't forget to subscribe and like, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.